This will be my final show performances in London. This will be it. This is it. And when I say this is it, it really means this is it. Of involuntary manslaughter, a felony, Dr. Murray. How do you plead? Your Honor, I am an innocent man. I therefore plead plea? not guilty. Thank you. I truly feel that Conrad Murray is simply the fall guy. This was definitely something that was premeditated that they had planned to do and they planned to take my brother out and my brother knew it and that's why he told me repeatedly and repeatedly and repeatedly that this was going to happen to him. He explained it to me. He explained it's because of my catalog which is my publishing and they're after it and they want it and they'll put, they want their hands on it and they want to take it away from me. So Michael developed this love-hate relationship with his catalog. I don't want it because it's going to destroy my life. No, it's mine. I'm going to keep it. I'm not going to let them rip it apart and take it from me. This went back and forth. I began to see his personality change. Michael had notes in his house saying how he hates John Branca, he hates Randy Fields, he doesn't want them around, he'll never fly with them. He, he just went on and on expressing how he felt about these people. These people were all involved. Mind you, the will, I truly believe and I know that the will is fake. Because Michael was in New York when the will was signed and they say he signed it in LA and he did not. And they know this. But yet they put themselves as the executors on this estate. There was another guy that was in the will, Barry Siegel, but he, he pleasantly removed himself from it. Why would he do that? Because he knew that it was fake and he wasn't going to get involved in the skullduggery. That's why.